Okay, so I'm gonna do this is awkward as hell, but I'm gonna do a I guess you can call it a haul or review, whatever. But I ordered some a packet from this website <coughs> to to collapse, and it's a mystery packet. So there's I think there's three different packets. Let me double check one second. Yeah, there's three different packets or well, tiers in the mystery packets, I guess. So I got mystery packet tier one, and it was. A total of let me double check a total of forty nine dollars oh, I had it right here forty nine dollars and ninety eight cents the shipping was free and um this is my first time hearing from this um, company but okay so tier one is our lowest level with a price of ninety four ninety nine you will be receiving up to 50% off of our items with this mystery packet, which is up to a hundred dollar value. Yeah, so and then it just has you. So I'm kind of like, because it has you pick out um your size in. It has you pick out your sizes in top and bottoms, and then you just put it in, and then I guess they do like a mystery packet for you within like those sizes that you pick but it doesn't ask if you're like a male or female so that's on like okay but and it's right here i haven't even opened it so and this is how it looks like and then i just paid the price because shipping was free i'm not sure why but i think it was because i it was my first time ordering i'm not sure but okay so here's the invoice so yeah one mystery packet size medium small because i'm a medium in bottoms and then a small on tops so that's what i picked i picked top small and then medium on my bottoms so let's see like if they do fit for the most part like i do fit in small everything so i'm gonna just go as i grab Okay, okay, my mom's gonna get hella pissed because I have enough blender bottles, but this is pretty cool. It's all nice, black, and sleek, and then it has the Till You Collapse logo. And this, I guess, this was like established in 2013. Y'all can see, but yeah. And I was actually looking into a black blender bottle the other day, I was at Walmart. Cause I have to go get my grandmother's uh, medication, and as I was waiting in line, um, I saw this cute ass um, black blender bottle. It was a bit different, but same as black. Okay, second bag. It, com it comes with this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, this is cute. So it comes padless. But it comes with the pads if you want to put it on. So it's a cute little sports bra. And this is really thick material. Let's see what size is it? Medium? Oh, this is a medium? Oh, I'm confused. What did I put then? Oh, sorry. I was saying it way off. Okay, I'm a small on bottoms and medium on tops. That's why I was like, wait, what? Yeah, because I'm like wider up here, like in my ribs. I always say that I'm gonna shave my ribs down and everyone's like, you're stupid. But anyways, I'm just kidding. Okay, so this is a medium black sports bra. And like I said, it comes without the pads, but you can add them in if you want to. And I'll be trying this on like after I go through it all. Okay, so those two come together. Ooh. I got some pink white. And if y'all know me, I'm not good with white because I get hella dirty. Oh, whoa, this is way out of my comfort zone, but we can try it out. This is a little bit too sussy. This is how it looks in the back. And then the sleeves are mesh, you can tell. Mesh. It doesn't say the prices, I would tell you, but it doesn't say it. Okay. Oh, what is this? And I kind of wish like it would ask you like your favorite colors, like 
what type of material because like I said like the white one is kind of out of my comfort zone because it's white it's mesh and it's hella cropped so we'll we'll see how it works out okay this is this is cute or whatever this is mesh as well this is the back I honestly probably wouldn't wear it just because I don't I'm not comfortable with um not spaghetti straps but um like tank top straps i like it more like to have a sleeve you know so that's why i'm saying like it would have been a bit better if like it asked you a few other questions like not just your size and top and bottoms but like if it asked you like what color you like what um sorry i keep on looking at the viewfinder i just realized i'm not looking there but i'm looking okay whatever i'm getting used to this it's been a while but yeah like i kind of wish it would like ask you like what color what like what material, what style, crop top, like all that. And then this is the last one I believe. Yeah. So this is the last one. And by the way, I just realized they all have the logo on it. I haven't showed them, but I'll show you guys right now. So these are some cute they look a bit darker in the camera but they're not as dark and then once again they're meshed right here i'm kind of not a fan of the mesh i don't know why don't ask me why i just i don't know why i don't like it but anyways look here's the logo in the back where the waist is on the back anyways and let me show you the logo on the other ones and then i'll try it on but you guys are probably like, whoa, I thought she was dead. No, I'm kidding. Um, where's the logo on this one? Oh, okay. The logo's on the back of this one. And they're all the TYC. The initials for Atelier Collapse. And then for this one, it's in the back. But like I said, we'll see how this works out. We'll see how it works out because I'm wearing makeup right now and I'm probably most likely going to get it dirty, but oh well, whatever. We'll just figure it out. But um, I'll just try all of them on, even though I'm kind of iffy about it now, but I'll try them all on just so you guys can see like how it looks like. And then um, that was it, right? Yeah. Yeah, that was it. So, um... Sorry, I'm picking up my mask. It's because I'm at my grandma's nutrition center. Because if you guys follow me like on Instagram and stuff, you guys know I don't really have a house right now. Well, I mean, I do have a house, but it's a long story. It's under like remodelation and stuff. And I don't have, like in the trailer where we're staying, it's kind of hard to um, do a video. So that's why I asked her if I could come and do it here. But anyways, let's go um, try it on. Mm. and i'm having my smoothie this is oh gosh okay so it's like a v8 juice i know y'all ain't asking me but i'm gonna tell you okay because i don't know um i feel awkward anyways it's the v8 juice so it's, it has like different fruit parts. yeah so it has like beets strawberries bananas and i forgot what other ones but it has other ones and then i added frozen blueberries i added frozen strawberries frozen mango, frozen pineapple, and peaches, frozen peaches. And then I added, um, so I've been trying out this, I forgot the brand of it, but I've been trying out this like green powder. So I added a scoop of that, and then I always add 0% um, Greek yogurt. And then I also add, um, if you guys know the like company Herbalife, I add the, they have like a 24, 24 fitness line. I just know it's 24, but they have a 24, so I have the chocolate powder of that one mixed with um, the formula one vanilla or protein, something like that. Um, I'm kind of, I don't know. I just added stuff in. But anyways, yeah, I'm drinking that. This is pretty cool though. I like this one. My mom's going to get mad because she just emptied out like all the thrastes and like los topes, so she's going to get pissed. But anyways, let me go try on the stuff. And that's why I was wearing like um, simple color. Like I'm wearing like my Nike 270s, just a regular V, 
um, gray shirt. And then my favorite workout leggings right now from, um, it's a brand Yogalicious. I always buy them at Ross. No, sorry, at Marshalls. I always buy them at Marshalls. I, I've seen them, no, I haven't seen them at Ross. I always buy them at Marshalls or TJ Maxx. But for the most part, Marshalls, because whenever I go, they always have my sizes there. Because I'm small in bottoms and medium in tops. But anyways, okay, let me go try this on. Okay, don't mind the mess. Like I said, I was trying to pick it up. But I don't know how I feel about this. It's kind of too sussy for me. Anyways, okay, the reason why I say that I don't like um, shirts like this is because, look, my veins are hella green and then i'm still working on my arms okay whatever so this is this one these are the ones that i tell you i got from marshall's but anyways this is it i don't know how i'm digging the whole mesh right here and then don't mind my bra because i was unprepared but this is it um yeah i think i may give this shirt away I mean, it's cute and all. I like it because it's like the material is super soft, but I'm not digging with this mesh and I'm not digging with this style cut. But anyways, yeah, this is the first shirt. Let me show you the other ones. This is the white shirt. Like I said, y'all, like I'm not used to this. Don't mind me. I'm still... Okay, yeah, this is awkward as fuck. But this is the shirt. Like I said, I wasn't prepared because I have a black bra on. Um, it's a little too much. I'd probably need my leggings to be hella high-waisted. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know. I'm just not used to it. This is out of my comfort zone, but this is really cute, actually. Like, I'm digging it only if I were used to how it looks like. But, um, yeah, this is it. I just, uh, I feel like it goes up a lot. But anyways. Oh, sorry. I have this thing. But anyways, yeah. This is it. And then let me show you guys the other two. Um, The other two, I'm going to wear this black sports bra. And the bluish, navyish, whatever the fuck color that is. Um, leggings together. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Okay. Okay, yeah. This one's hella out of my comfort zone. Um, I don't know how I feel about this. The leggings are all right. I've just noticed already that they fall down real quick. Okay, and then you guys know how I talked about the mesh. So look, usually I don't like mesh because it's all the way to the bottom. So I usually have to hem all my clothes because your girl's four nine and a half. I'm out of breath. Hold up. Your girl's four nine and a half, so I usually have to hem all my clothes for it to be not for it not to be so long. And but yeah. It's alright, it's alright. And then I'm wearing just my regular bra under this because I was too lazy to take my time and put the pads into the sports bra. But this is it. I guess, don't mind my long hair. Like I said, this is all hella out of my comfort zone. I mean, I do know that I can wear the sports bra. Oh, sorry, my belly dolls. It's because I have bangs, but I'm trying to grow them out. Like I said, I do know I can wear the sports bra under another shirt. But yeah, I just, I personally wouldn't wear go out or work out with just like this because I just I don't feel comfortable but yeah this is it um let me get back into my clothes and I'll end the video but yeah this is it okay so I already changed back into my clothes so overall I I like the the leggings, but like I said, it mesh isn't my thing. I don't think it will be. But I did notice that these leggings are from the premium line that they have, I guess. I, I haven't really looked into their stuff. I just was like, oh, okay. You know what, how I found out about them? I was on Instagram, and you know when you're watching stories and like the 
like popular pages ads come up so that's how i saw it and they were saying like i was like one of those like girl she was talking about it so i was like oh, okay and then you just swipe up and it takes you to the link that's how i found out about it but other than that i didn't look into like more of their clothing or i think i did it's just that it was while i was getting ready to eat so i like exit out i just placed my order and the cool thing is that like if you're like me i buy a lot of things with apple pay so with that clothing line you can pay with apple pay so um, i was just like and then yeah you know but other than that like okay so yeah i like them i like the color i actually have been wanting some leggings this color i'm just not digging the mesh um so I, I will try out to work out with them once or twice if anything um my grandmother and my mom fit and we all fit into pretty much the same clothes so if anything like i may give it to them um second the sport the sports bra i really i'm part of the itty bitty titty me so i really don't have a need to wear a sports bra like just regular bra and a t-shirt like we're good you know but this one is really cute um I, I think that if I were to add in the pads, then it would be, like, perfect, you know? But right now, um, yeah, it was good. I just for sure would be using, like, high-waisted leggings. Like, high-waisted leggings. Because I'm just not used to it. It's a little bit too sassy to add in my comfort zone for me. But yeah, like, I like this one. Oh, and this one is also from the premium line. Yeah. Okay, and then this one. Wait, I think they're all from the premium line because they all say premium line. A uh, hill. Yeah, they all are. Okay, so yeah, I don't know. Okay, oh, weird. Oh, my bad. Okay, this one. This one was cute. I'm just not really. This is a, like a coral color. It looks kind of orange in camera, but it's a coral color. In general, I'm not a coral, coral colored person on me i feel like these type of colors make me look a bit more tan than what i am but um yeah for sure this one i probably would give it like to my grandma or something she's a size medium in tops and this is a medium I believe. is it yeah. yeah and then last one this one this one was actually really cute but I already got makeup on it right there, see, when I was like sleeping it on. So that's why I'm saying like, I'm the type of person that if I, like, I'm gonna wear like, okay, like, this is like cute fashion, right? Workout fashion. So if I'm gonna wear this, I need to make sure my hair and my makeup is done. I'm not just gonna wear a cute top, cute outfit, looking all full and from my face and up, you know? Like, that's just me, so. Oh, sorry, my hair. <laughs> so I I wouldn't wear this without makeup. So it's for sure for a fact I was gonna be getting dirty. But what I am gonna do, I'm gonna look into it the website and see if they have the same exact one but in black. Cause I love everything black, like clothes, shoes, black, black, black. Um, shoes, black and white. But for the most part, I like my clothing. I'm that girl that will wear black on black on black. And black hair yeah that's me but yeah i'm gonna look into a black one of those and then the cup i mean i already know how be beauty blenders how you know how blender bottles work so i know this is a good one like i can be using it and stuff um yeah it's oh the only thing is that this one doesn't come with the little handle that like is right here it's like a little handle that comes here all my other blender bottles do have it but um this one doesn't so i'll have to be carrying it like this with the other ones i usually just hook my finger in it and i'll like hold it but other than that it's the same it comes with its little whisk ball whisk but yeah other than that i guess this was uh, i guess this was an all right purchase um Like I said, if it wasn't out of my comfort zone, I'd wear it, yeah. But if anything, I'm probably just gonna keep the black sports bra and try out the blue leggings a few times. If not, I'd probably just keep, 
keep the black sports bra and then like give the rest to anyone else maybe i'll keep the white one but like i said it's just gonna be getting dirty so many times and i'm the type of person that if i have like a makeup stain like right here like it just throws everything off so that's why i'm gonna look into the black that they have the same exact shirt but in black other than that it was alright. The material and all of them are good. I mean, the mesh is mesh, but it's a good mesh. It's not like that. It's a pretty thick mesh material. It's not like the other mesh ones that is like super stretchy and like if you if your nail like goes into it, like it rips a hole into it. No, like it feels good. It feels like good mesh. I don't know. Yeah. If you're you're if you're a girl, you'll understand what I mean about like good mesh. But anyways. Um, I think that's all I know I haven't done a video in like forever it's been a couple years but um, I'm trying to get into doing videos again I'm just super awkward I have to like get in the zone and stuff and I'm out of breath but um, and don't mind me i'm always having fucking brain farts like i'm always forgetting like if i'm talking and then like someone else comes in and distracts me like it happens way too much but anyways yeah so i'm trying to get into doing videos again um i have asked on instagram like oh i'm gonna make a video what do you guys want to watch but all the fucking haters no i'm kidding but nobody tells me shit so i'm just like mm. all right i'm not gonna just anything and yeah and then i'm always working like i have a full-time job but um either way i get home i go in 7 45 to 4 45 i get home because it's not in the town where i live so i get home like around 5 30 or so but the sun's still out by then so i can start making videos i mean i just need to know what you guys want to watch um but yeah come on guys i'm trying to become youtube famous and quit my job no, I'm kidding. Okay, a little bit, but yeah. But anyways, like I said, let me know what you guys think about this. I'll leave the link for this clothing line down below. Um, here, I'll show you guys the link either way on here. Can you see it? There we go. Okay, but yeah. Other than that, yeah, like... Just let me know what you guys would like to see. Um, it's been about like a year, almost a year and a half. Almost, I don't know. I'm not keeping track or whatever. It's been a long ass time. I've been working out. Um, I've been going to like um, booty band classes. But with this whole fucking corona time shit. It's been like postponed, but they still have them online. But like I said, I live on a trailer, so I can't really work out in there. I can't always like ask my grandma like, hey, can I come and work out here? I mean, I can, but it's like I have to drive here. It's not long of a drive, but still either way. It's like I just want to change and be in my workout clothes, put on the live and start working out. But it's like I have to drive over there and then drive back. But yeah. Um... I'm just waiting for all this bullshit to go down and like get out of like the quarantine shit. I mean, I'm an essential worker, so I still have to go to work. But I mean, yeah. You know, a lot of people are getting their hours cut, or I guess from what I've been hearing, I don't really know. That uh, I doubt I'll be getting my hours cut or like days cut, only because. Um, where I work, I'm a floater, so I do like different things. Um, right now, I'm going way off track, but anyways, yeah, where I work is like I do different things, so pretty sure like if she doesn't need me for this thing, she'll need me for this thing, so I'm always going to be working. But yeah, anyways, like I said, um, Thanks for watching, if y'all even are fucking watching, but thanks for watching. I'm sorry I'm so awkward, but I'll, I promise I'll get better at it, okay? Yeah. Oh, shit.